on the live. For four a days. Tempe Wells Fargo employee died at her desk. And 12 News is now confirming that it may have taken as many as four days for anyone in the office to notice. Good evening and thanks so much for joining us for 12 News at 10. I'm Kariba Devine. I'm Mark Curtis. It's a story we first reported yesterday. Tonight, Tempe police are confirming the timeline of when the woman clocked in to when her colleagues found the body. 12 News journalist I Gabriella Becerra is in the studio with new details tonight. Gabby, four days. I mean, this poor woman went four days undiscovered. It's hard to believe. And that's a question many employees are asking themselves tonight. I spoke with an employee who said that she shared her perspective on the workplace environment, and they say it's a big building, but most people don't work there on a daily basis. A Wells Fargo employee went to work the morning of Friday, August 16th, and never went home. Tempe police tell 12 News 60-year-old Denise Prudhomme scanned into work at 7 o'clock in the morning. Four days later, police responded to the office building near Washington Street and Priest Drive for reports of a subject down. Prudhomme was declared dead. The Tempe Police Criminal Investigation Bureau is investigating, but do not suspect foul play. A Wells Fargo employee exclusively spoke with 12 News, but asked not to be recorded or identified out of fear for their job. They say a colleague found Prudhomme dead at her desk in a cubicle while walking around the building on Tuesday, August 20th. Prudhomme's cubicle was reportedly on the third floor and away from the main aisle. This employee says several people had smelled a foul odor but passed it off as faulty plumbing. They say while most Wells Fargo employees at this Tempe location work remote, the building has 24-7 security and someone should have found Prudhomme soon the incident left several employees feeling scared and uneasy. This employee wants to see new safety protocols in place, telling me, quote, it's negligence in some part. A different worker also spoke with 12 News anonymously. So it was yeah. just Unbelievable. uncomfortable. Again, calling on the company this to do more. Body was there about four days before it's anybody found it, before anybody walked like up this, to her. Man just to say hi, make sure she's okay. She was just laying on her desk. A Wells Fargo spokesperson previously sent 12 News a statement saying in part, we are deeply saddened by the tragic loss of our colleague at our Tempe office, adding counselors through our employee assistance consulting service are available to support employees. An employee tells me their direct management offered those services, addressed the incident, and told workers the building was thoroughly cleaned. And a Wells Fargo spokesperson did not have new information to share with me tonight. The Maricopa County Medical Examiner is investigating the cause of death. In studio, Gabriela Becerra, 12 News. All right, Gabby, thank you. Stuff is getting weird. How in the world in the unalive for four days? Join the family if you're new to the family. Join the family.